honestly at first i was like i don't not sure why everyone does the talking into the phone microphone thing but now i get it it's a lot less awkward when you're holding something anyways we are here to get over my fear of talking to a camera and doing this youtube thing because it's very scary So I've been crafting the whole morning, and it's not going well, to be honest. I'm trying to make phone charms, but I think the clay I'm using is too soft, so they kind of just look blobular. I'm working on my next shop update. I haven't had one since December, so it's been like three months now, and I'm very long overdue to add new things to my shop. It's been kind of slow, so hopefully this will revive things a little bit. We will see. I don't know what else to say. Bulleted list, numbered list, block quotes, and inline codes in your WhatsApp. I'm not like that though. Person, so I'm sure they're hoping people will use this for because they have those like communities and you can kind of post blog posts in WhatsApp. I don't know. So Just for our content. So. Yeah, exactly. But I think there's like a likes and quotes. I don't know. I should um, I shut that down for video. I fact check that a couple in, from Penguin was one sixth of the price of a TV. You could per yes. Or like infer that from the data. Do you watch Love Island at 8:30 p.m. TRT? You have. I just made all of these, and then I'm gonna texture and color the toast. Okay, so the plan today is just to restock these designs. We have the pancake one, and then the melon bread fun strap. been crafting basically this entire morning as you can see by the state of my desk here is what i made i'm a little bit rusty because i haven't been crafting oops it's been kind of slow since i haven't really been crafting that much for the past couple of months but i'm trying to get back into it I just realized I haven't introduced myself in this video, so hi, I'm Ivana, I run Haikino. I'm having such a hard time because I normally don't talk to myself, so this is a very awkward experience for me, to be honest. Let's finish up these pancake phone charms, and then maybe I will also make some melon bread ones today, or 
I can try making something new, and then we can make the melon bread one some other day. These are all the charms that I'm gonna have this shop update. I made new melon bread charms. This time I textured it a little bit more and I think it looks cuter like this. And then we have two new designs for the phone charms. So there's this roll cake one and then the toast one. So hopefully today I will be able to sand, paint, and glaze all of these. painting all of the charms and I might wait a little bit longer before I glaze them just so the paint can dry a little bit more. I don't know why but a lot of them their eyes turned out a little bigger than last time. But I think they came out pretty cute.
Okay, so I wanted to hop on here with a little bit of a voiceover, since I like watching studio vlogs with voiceovers myself, since I usually have them on in the background while I'm working. But when I was working on the shop update, I was unintentionally putting a lot of pressure on myself to make a lot of products. I felt like since it was a while since my previous shop update, I felt like I needed to come back with a lot of different products to add to the shop. I was talking about it with my friend, and they just asked me, why do you need a big shop update? And that kind of just put things into perspective for me since I realized that, oh, I actually don't need to do that and I can just add what I make as I go, even if it is just like a couple items. Um, so I ended up just making the phone straps and the pins that you will see later. And yeah. So I was making some test backing cards for the clay pin set and I made them the same width as the backing cards I made for the phone straps but since there's a lot more, I don't know, vertical action, um, it won't fit in the bag so I will probably have to make it a little bit more narrow to account for the height and then there's also just some other adjustments I want to make to the graphics. I think maybe I will want to mark where I want each pin to go. That's the first draft, the second one, and then the third one I finally was like, wait, I can just turn it 90 degrees so the flap closes on the side instead of on the bottom, and that way I have a lot more space to work with. I was supposed to wake up earlier today, but I didn't do that, so let's go take some pictures. Okay, so these are the new backing card designs that I made, and to be honest, I'm not sure if I really like them. I feel like it's a bit much with the phone strap and everything. I think I might just have to cut it out and see. Hate it, but I also don't love it.
print it on like regular printer paper because it's just a test print. But I think it came out pretty cute. The colors are a little bit light, but I kind of like it like that. Okay, so it is another day and today should be relatively chill. I took all the product photos and edited them yesterday, so today we'll just be adding the listings and then editing the vlog that you're watching right now. And I think I might also try to cut out the backing cards and pre-package everything because previously I would package I would package the things as I get the order, but then I realized that that actually takes up a lot of my time just having to do them individually, so I think maybe if I do them all at once be a little bit faster um yeah other than that there's not much else to do for the shop so let us go I finally got blades because I was cutting everything by hand with an X-Acto knife and a ruler. But I have this really ancient paper cutter at home, but it just never had blades.
because I realized I didn't update that I actually uploaded the shop. So everything is live now. And then I just made an Instagram reel to share all the new items I made. And then also I quickly made graphics for an Instagram post as well. And then I usually also like to add links to everything in my stories so it's easy to access. Thank you so much for watching to the end of this video. I know it ended up being kind of a long one, so I hope I was able to keep you company while you worked. Um, I had a lot of fun filming and editing this, so hopefully there will be more studio vlogs in the future. If you liked it, please be sure to give a like comment and subscribe all that youtube jazz and yeah i'll see you guys next time bye you don't want to know how many times i refilmed this